All right, this holiday season, a new Christmas comedy is out. It's called Jingle Smells. It is a fun family movie. It's heartwarming, and it also has an anti-woke message. Take a look. You know, it's very hard to find a place that even comes close to being worthy of your beauty. It's romantic. It's about you and me alone. Wow, look at the two of you. Merry Christmas, America. Hollywood has canceled Mason Stone. Stone will be digitally replaced by AI. Boycott Stone! We will no longer be manufacturing Mason Stone characters. Get them all out of here by Christmas Eve. You gotta be kidding me. How'd you get it? Oh, oh fell off the truck. There was a truck involved. The mysterious gift giver has struck again. If you get busted with those toys, you're done. And you made me an accessory. Well, you know what they say, some accessories are required. Am I smiling? No. Jingle smells, jingle smells, stinking all the way. They called me Jingle Smells. Yeah, I know. It's a fun movie. Yes, obviously, a minute, and one of the executive producers. Anyway, here now is one of the stars of Jingle Smells, actor John Schneider. Uh, all right, you're amazing in the movie. Uh, I've always known you're amazing. It was great, great to have the opportunity to be on this project with you. Uh, well, thank you very much. It was so wonderful to be, uh, be involved in a movie that the whole family could watch. You know, we yeah. used to do mo movies and television like, dare I say, Dukes of Hazard, like Smallville. Where people, whether with whether they were four years old or ninety-four years old, they enjoyed the same programming, and that's right. what Jingle Smells is. Plus, you know, having been probably, I would I would say one of the first groups to be canceled by cancel culture, you know, the Dukes <laughs> of Hazard because of the uh, rebel flag. You know, I I am I have been an action figure that has been canceled. So I love doing this movie. I really did. Thank you for making it happen. So what's interesting is is something for the kids, obviously, something for the parents. Um, it features Nick Gutman, uh, who Ben Davies does a great job playing this role. Oh, he yeah. takes a job with your, well, how do you say it? Let's say offbeat well, uh, garbage men buddies. <laughs> with what? Yeah, I, I get him a job in, in the sanitation department because right. he doesn't get a job on his own. And uh, he finds these discarded toys and gives them to children uh, for for Christmas, you know. And I'm one of the founders of Children's Miracle Network Hospitals. So the fact that this movie takes place in children's hospitals really speaks well to me as well. So because it's at the end of his workday, you know, he smells a little bit. So the kids, like mm -hmm. we just saw, called him Jingle Smells. And uh, I, I just think it's wonderful. I really do. Folks, jinglesmells.movie, jinglesmells.movie. If you want to get so, a hold of something, uh, you want you want to buy a DVD. But you, you want to send them it. on this mission to destroy, you know, perfectly good toys by Christmas Eve. They're pulled from the the shelves. Um, yes. Based on, you know, being canceled, him being canceled for his patriotic views, and instead, you know, he ends up being the good guy, the the uh, the Robin Hood of the movie. So what I love about it is parents get to see, oh, uh, the woke world gets defeated and all in the spirit of Christmas, which I really love. Absolutely. You know, and, and uh, like on Dukes of Hazard, the good guys get in trouble for doing the right thing. So this, this movie, I think, will speak to many, many people. Um, and, and, and like I said, it's something everyone can watch at the same time. And it pokes a finger in the eye of the woke culture, which we need to do, Sean. We need to do it. I mean, it's it's time that we just said enough is enough. Don't you think? Yeah. I, I, I got to tell you, I think it's time. You know, look, there are some movies that are timeless. And I don't, I don't know, I just... Just the whole notion of this and how relevant it is to, to today's world. Um, it's interesting, your background, your experience, what you bring to the film. And there's a hero in this film, and I love that part of it. And uh, the fact that it connects to real-life cancel culture makes me even more happy. My entire career, yeah. people, too, have tried to cancel me, and I'm like, well, I'm still here. Uh, they haven't been successful yet. Uh, all right, so well, people you know, the watch truth it. Will, the truth will set you free, right? The truth will set Amen. you free. So, so for folks who are watching this, if you're a Dukes of Hazard fan, you're going to love it. If you're a Smallville fan, you know this is kind of Dukes of Hazard, uh, true modern day Robin Hoods meet Jonathan Kent from Smallville. So uh, it's a great opportunity. It's a wonderful time to be able to sit with your family, watch a movie for a change, where you can talk about it after. It it is educational, but it doesn't beat you over the head.
but it'll give you something to talk about with your family afterwards, which I think is entertainment's job, really. That's what I think entertainment is supposed to do. Well, you're great at it. It was uh, great to have an opportunity to work with you. Uh, people looking for it, it's on Rumble. The website is what? Jinglesmells.movie. Jinglesmells.movie. Yeah. Jinglesmells.movie. Or you can go to my website, which is John Schneider Studios. Dot com, get a DVD, check out what we have at the store. Uh, but I applaud you for making this movie happen. It wouldn't have happened without you. So, well, it's my actually, it was fun for me to do. I enjoyed every part of it. The worst part of it is me being on screen, but the best part is when you're on screen. Uh, John Schneider, <laughs> uh, great to see you, my friend. I hope people will find it. Jingle Smells. Great to see movie. You as well, Merry Christmas, everybody. You take care. God bless you. Bye bye. Merry Christmas. God bless you, my friend. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.